Sister wives Robin Brown slips up, throws Cody under bus, dear loves, welcome to USA Drama. Please do subscribe my YouTube channel. Admittedly, Sister Wives star Cody Brown says he could be spiteful about the Coyote Pass property. When Mary Brown confronts Cody and Robin Brown, they seem to scramble to justify their actions. Robin accidentally slips up while defending Cody's choices, but inadvertently throws him under the BUS.IN. In the preview for the upcoming episode of Sister Wives, Cody Brown sits down with Mary and Robin Brown to discuss Coyote Pass. In many ways, Mary is distraught after talking with Janelle Brown about the land. Seemingly, the idea of Cody and Robin not doing right by her was eye-opening. While Janelle felt compelled to give her a heads up that Cody could screw them over, Mary was baffled they might not be fair in the matter. Although Cody confesses he has thought about screwing them, he says his wife with a conscience won't let H.I.M.W.T. win Mary. Confronts Cody and Robin, they appear to try and wriggle out of giving her the answers she wants. Mary became concerned about the property division, since her name is only on one plot that also has Cody and Janelle listed. In some ways, Mary brought it up as Janelle's concern, giving Cody and Robin details that Janelle had divulged in their private discussion about the land. However, Janelle states she didn't want to start drama, but instead wanted Mary to have education about business matters. Unfortunately, Mary says she had no involvement in the process of the names on each property, and now she feels vulnerable. But Robin claims Cody did the assignments at random. However, fans see that Robin's peacemaking may have just thrown Cody under the BUS. When watching the preview, some fans think Robin Brown truly slipped up and threw Cody under the bus. On Reddit, one Sister Wives fan laid out several loopholes for Mary and Janelle Brown about the Coyote Pass property contract. When Robin started justifying Cody's decisions, she inadvertently left room for their lawyers to swoop in. First, a user says, Robin just made the case for why Janelle and Mary are each entitled to one-fourth of Coyote Pass. Then, they explain in the sneak peek for the next episode, Robin just 100% made the case for why Mary and Janelle are legally entitled to their fair share of CP, because the contracts are unenforceable under Arizona law, and even if they were enforceable, Robin's statement just handed over a misrepresentation defense to Mary and Janelle. See the screenshots below. Furthermore, the Redditor discusses how Robin Brown's innocent excuses opened a counterclaim for Janelle and Mary to argue. They say Robin says that, in dividing the lots, Cody quickly chose at random which wives' names would be on each CP plot, and she also states that the land division was supposed to be temporary. Personally, I don't believe Robin is telling the truth here, but either way, Mary and Janelle now can argue. Other contract offenses that may apply too, such as unconscionability, fraud, undue influence, violations of fiduciary duty if Cody entered the contracts using the LLC Etsy. So whether Robin is lying or telling the truth about this, she just unwittingly handed over the legal arguments to Janelle and Mary that would void the CP contracts. I hope their lawyers are all over this dot, another fan points out, and also the McMansion, Robin stated the house was not supposed to just hers. It was an investment for the family, which is funny because Robin seems to have contributed zero toward that house. It was paid for by Mary and Janelle, but that's none of my business. It's funny because Robin's name is on more than one sister wife's land in her house. How did that happen, Sobin? Was that just random too? Another sister wife's fan theorizes that the legal actions happened before Robin Brown was defending the decisions. While others think the devil is in the details and Mary and Janelle Brown may be up a creek. Robin is either dumb as hell or the negotiation was already complete and Janelle slash Mary got their fair share or else Robin really believes in being fair with this doubtful. I think they've already come to an agreement and simply not recorded it legally yet. But see, they don't want to ruin the finale. What do you think? Did Robin Brown just throw Cody Brown under the bus? Do you think she was trying to help him or wiggle out of any responsibility? 